This is from the Denarland Highlights from May 21st, 2020. Uh, Frank 26, a uh, KTFA article from the Parliament has been released to avoid all confusion, especially for the citizens. Article, quote, a proposal on government table to face the parliamentary economic and financial crisis warns. Quotes, raising the dollar exchange rate to face the financial crisis and preserve the hard currency is one of the proposals and monetary measures that the state may take to avoid liquidity crisis. The flotation does not constitute an increase in the value of the Iraqi dinar, but rather we will see an increase in the exchange rates of the dollar due to the lack of its acquisition in the global market, especially with the decline in global oil prices. The flotation is taken in light of the stable financial conditions of the state, as well as the diversification of the economy and its dependence on resources other than oil. This article is clearly stating that the IQD has to go up in value through their exchange rate. Notice what they say about the float. The information is flowing very rapidly now. I mean rapidly about the redomination, the monetary reform, the reinstatement of their currency. This article, that blew everybody up. What they're trying to tell you is that it's not that the Iraqi dinar is going down in value. In fact, a few days ago, they said they were going to print a whole bunch of currency and the people in Iraq, my fireflies, they lost it. Look, guys, it's their job to confuse you. It's all fake news. The confusion seems to have ironed itself out, in my opinion. Today, we see this article from the meeting with the CBI and the Fab Four clearly explaining the true path of monetary reform. The RD is becoming very, very loud. They're implementing a new currency with a new rate. They're fully committed to raising the value of their currency. Where is the redomination? Where are we in that process? I think we're ready to see a change. Okay, from Bruce, the big call. Uh, so we had some things that slowed down, slowed the process down over the last three to four days. I believe what's happening now is they're catching up. In my opinion, it's running a little behind. We're ready to begin. We think our part of it should come this week. Though I believe we are slightly behind the original schedule, I'm going to suggest to everybody just take a deep breath, relax, know that we're in the right moment, Make sure everybody understands what on par means when it comes to currencies. It means that the currencies being on par with each other means having the same value, that it is not now. This is starting June 2nd, and if everything holds to the current pace, the Iraqi dinar would have the value of $1 minus 1 dinar equals $1. Um, Militiaman KTFA. Uh, just as Frank Guru Frank 26 has taught, and even as Dr. Shabibi has mentioned in the past, that there will be confusion and propaganda at the end game. There's only one real option and will do, in my opinion, as in they will raise the exchange rate of the IQD by reducing the amount of dinars to buy dollars. There is a chart from the CBI. It's noted to have been updated yesterday. The CBI presently shows the public exposure of an increase in the money issuance. Guru Delta told us days ago on the Arabic side of the CBI that they did the increase in currency issuance, which means that what we believe from their data is to be small category no notes or even coins. Now, they are public about it on the CBI site. The facts speak loudly, in my opinion, that they are just about now going into a market economy. Everything is ready and waiting. They can't do that without raising the value of the IQD, in my opinion. I think everyone by now should know that we all have studied to date. We knew this was to come at the end. The rear should fall in very short order. Real effective exchange rate. Uh, one more thing. We know they have been on film showing the destruction of large notes and in mass quantities. The facts also support the large amount of money spent printing currency and minting coins. It's a new issuance being reflected on the CBI site. Uh, we watch for the rear. Let's see what the days bring us in my opinion. A uh, question, what is the real effective exchange rate or the rear? Investopedia, the real effective exchange rate or rear is the weighted average of a country's currency in relation to an index or a basket of other major currencies. The weights are determined by comparing the relative trade balance of a country's currency against each country within the index. This exchange rate is used to determine an individual's country's currency relative to the other major currencies in the index. Okay, Mark Z via PDK, nothing happened overnight as expected by my sources. I'm still looking for it sometime before June 1st. We're seeing it play out before our eyes. 
We just do not know the exact timing and no one is supposed to. That's all for now. Thanks for tuning in.